You know, for months, the Summit County Jail didn't have a reported COVID-19 case. But tonight, families are concerned that there's an outbreak at the jail. So News 5's Amanda Van Allen spoke exclusively to a mom who says her son is in that jail battling COVID. She's terrified. And I told them that my son is asthmatic and that I'm worried about him. A mom who isn't using her name says her son is in the Summit County Jail with COVID. I blame the county jail because they're not making sure these inmates have masks and their social distancing. She says the jail wasn't taking enough precautions. He's been locked up there since April. They didn't receive the mask until December 2nd, he said. Her 19-year-old son, Dante Barry, who is serving three years for aggravated robbery, isn't alone. After months of the Summit County Jail reporting it had no confirmed COVID cases, they had an outbreak. Right now, there are 41 inmates with COVID. Mom says it was a while before her son even got tested. He started feeling sick, so he started getting a sore throat, stuffy nose, things like that. So I called the county, talked to the sheriffs, I talked to the nurses. I talked to Bill Holland, the inspector for the Summit County Jail, about the outbreak. He says the jail got its first confirmed case December 8th, but they're not sure how it happened. We did contact tracing. Uh, but it is very difficult to kind of trace it back to patient zero, if you will, just because of the amount of community spread. Holland says since the outbreak, things have changed. We are minimizing movements throughout the facility and outside of the facility. Um, we're trying to utilize uh, remote court appearances as much as possible. Face-to-face um, -face interactions between inmates, uh, we're limiting. He says in response to Barry's mom complaining about her son not having a mask since all inmates were quarantined for 14 days before joining the others and that method had been working for months. They weren't giving out masks until now. At that point, we, we didn't have any positives and we were, you know, we were successful in what we were doing. Um, certain areas in the facility, inmates were given masks. They just weren't distributed throughout the facility like they are now. Barry's mom says she wants more to be done. At the end of the day, he's still human, just like the other inmates are. Amanda Van Allen, News 5.